We settled Mars over a century ago. Making this dusty rock our home wasn't easy, but the promise that led us across the void was freedom, something my family's bled for many times. For generations, we Masons have fought for the Red Faction. Many were heroes, but heroes have enemies, and one, a self-styled messiah named Adam Hale, has returned with an army to conquer Mars. It's a war he's losing. Now Hale's cultists have captured the Terraformer, the one thing keeping our atmosphere stable, and plan to destroy it. If the Terraformer goes down, we go down with it. We're approaching the target, so listen up, people. Intel confirms that Marauder cultists led by Hale himself have overrun the Terraformer. Red Faction Command speculates that Adam Hale is planning a Pyrrhic victory. Yeah, uh, uh, what, Sarge? In other words, private. The cultists have gone kamikaze. You see that nasty storm front ahead? Hale's already monkey wrenched one of the atmosphere generators. Yeah, and what's a monkey wrench? It's a Pyrrhic victory. You my specialist? Darius Mason, third engineers. Mason. <laughs> Should have figured you'd volunteer for this one. Well, you better know your shit. Because once the hostiles are down, we need that damage reversed before the whole damn sky falls in. Understood, Sergeant. Remember, Adam Hell is kill on sight. Now lock and load. Conditions deteriorating. Hang on, it's gonna get rough. Darius, this is your situational awareness module. Are you still functional? Yeah, Sam. Oh. I need to assess your vitals. Sam, this isn't the time to... Look up. Are we done, Mother? Diagnosis complete. You have a slight concussion. I'm okay, Sam. Assessing combat reflex. Please focus on the target. Once more. Darius, the Nanoforge was knocked offline in the crash. I'm rebooting the system. Is it okay? Yes, but it will take some time to restore full functionality. Keep me posted, Sam. We can't complete the mission without it. I don't suppose you can radio Alpha to pick us up. The proximity to the terraformer is interfering with my transmissions. See if there's a workaround. Damn it. Doors blocked. Knocking out the power sources should lower the shield generator. Here we go, Sam. Hostiles on the bridge! I need an airstrike at 0803! Coming in hot! Nice shot, Coop!
Here comes the cavalry. Sergeant! Sergeant, it's Mason! Unable to maintain radio contact. We've got to get to the terraformer. Darius, I've established radio contact with Sergeant Winters. We can't secure the first objective. I repeat, we are taking heavy casualties at the terraformer entrance. If anyone's out there, Hell's cultists have dug in, and we can't... Sarge, it's Mason! Mason, thought we'd lost you back there. I was taking a shortcut. That shit ain't funny, soldier. Now get your ass inside, and stop Hell before he completes his plan. Roger that. Stay focused in there. It's swarming with hostiles. Repair functionality has been restored on the Nanoforge. Just in time. Give me a sit rep, Sam. No movement detected in the cargo bay. Good. I could use a breather. to repair the crates. Oh, right. getting up from that. This door leads to the core? Affirmative. What is the plan once we are inside? 
Pray we aren't too late. Impact is online. Mason, what's your status? I'm inside. Good. The cultures have tripped down near every security system in the building. Every sector is on lockdown. You'll need to clear each one before the system reboots. Yes, sir. Hurry. We don't have much time. Just inbound. Damn it. that. Lining the core with explosives. If Hale brings this place down, the whole planet is screwed.
the area has sustained a significant amount of damage. We need to stop Hale, now! Gotta be somewhere. Hmm. 
Mason. Is the target there? No, Sarge. Hale was reported moving this way. Reported by who? Wounded rifleman. Just passed him near the main reactor. Only friendlies in this section are you and me, soldier. When the terraformer fell, the surface became a storm-blasted wasteland. We were forced deep underground into caverns and mines. In one moment, Adam Hale had crushed decades of Martian hopes and dreams. Sergeant Winters claimed the mission's failure was not my own. It sure as hell didn't feel that way.